everybody, Rick Needham handicapping the races from my hometown track, Philadelphia Park in Ben Salem, PA. It is Tuesday afternoon, September the 16th, and this is my day at the track.com race of the day. I'm going to focus on race 8 this afternoon, folks, 3.22 p.m. Eastern Post for the 6.5 furlong sprint on the dirt. Three-year-olds racing for an allowance purse of $44,000. Contenders number through True Rays, number 6, Western Pine, number 1, Good Day, Mate, and number 7, Just a Touch. Number three, True Rays, the overall speed leader in this allowance field today, sprinting at her about today's distance of six and a half for once on the dirt. It's nice early speed abilities to complement for this sprint. He's hit the board in four of his last five, including a power run win in his second race back. Goes to the post with the skills of the jockey trainer tandem of Ryan Barber and Scott Lake in his corner. They've hit the board with 66% of their entry saddle as a team to date. As noted on numerous occasions in the past, Mr. Lake is annually one of North America's leading trainers in terms of win percentages. Race 8 summary, number 3, True Rays, tops the contenders list, which also includes number 6, Western Pine, number 1, Good Day Mate, and number 7, Just a Touch, 3617 in the 8th today from Philly Park. A couple of bonus long shots for you as usual, folks. Let's go to Suffolk Downs in Massachusetts first, race 6. 10 to 1 bomb, number 3, Lulu's Secret. The overall speed leader in this claiming field, racing at or about today's distance of a mile 70 yards on the turf. Race at Mountaineer Park in Chester, West Virginia tonight as well. Race 4, number 3, claiming the snore, 9 to 2 in the morning line. Qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony and is the speed leader in this claiming field, sprinting at or about tonight's distance of 5 and 1 half furlongs on the dirt. So from Philly Park on a Tuesday afternoon, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.